Imagine you're suffering from excruciating knee pain, the kind that makes every step feel like torture. Doctors tell you surgery is your only option, until now. What if a simple gel injection could regrow your damaged joint cartilage, erase the pain, and get you back on your feet in weeks? No scalpels, no long recovery, just pure regeneration. Sounds like science fiction, right? Well, viral posts exploding across social media in 2025 claim German scientists have cracked the code with a revolutionary gel called Chondrofiller. But hold on, is this the breakthrough we've all been waiting for? Or is there a twist that could shatter the dream? Stick around, because today we're diving deep into the facts, the myths, and the future of cartilage repair. By the end of this video, you'll know if this gel is worth the hype and it might just save you from falling for the next big scam. Let's uncover the truth. First off, let's set the scene. It's August 2025, and suddenly, your feed is flooded. Posts from Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, even threads screaming about a brand new German gel that's about to change medicine forever. They say it's developed by top scientists, awaiting approval by 2026, and it can heal joints without a single incision. One post even claims it restores full mobility in just two months with zero risks or rehab. Exciting, huh? But here's where the suspense builds. What if I told you this isn't new at all? What if the real story has been hiding in plain sight for over a decade? Before we reveal the bombshell, let's break down what cartilage damage really means because understanding the problem is key to appreciating any solution. Cartilage is that smooth, rubbery tissue cushioning your joints. Think of it as nature's shock absorber. But unlike skin or muscle, it doesn't heal well on its own. Injuries from sports, accidents, or just aging can lead to defects that cause swelling, stiffness, and that dreaded grinding pain. Osteoarthritis affects millions worldwide, and traditional fixes, painkillers, physical therapy, or invasive surgeries like joint replacements. These work, but they come with risks, infections, long downtime, and no guarantee of lasting relief. So when rumors of a gel that regrows cartilage hit the internet, it's no wonder people went wild. But pause for a second. If this gel is as magical as claimed, why hasn't everyone heard of it before 2025? That's the question we'll answer next. Stay tuned, because the origin story might surprise you. Enter Chandra Filler, the star of this viral sensation. Developed in collaboration with Germany's prestigious Fraunhofer Institute for Interfacial Engineering and Biotechnology in Stuttgart, this collagen-based gel promises to repair damaged cartilage. But here's the first big reveal. It's not a 2025 invention. Chandrafiller has been around since 2013. That's right, over a decade old. Social media posts got it wrong by calling it brand new and hyping it as awaiting Europe-wide approval next year. In reality, it's already approved and in use in many countries, including Germany. So why the sudden buzz? Blame clickbait pages like Forest Hunts, which twisted facts from older announcements to go viral. But don't click away yet. Even if it's not new, does it actually work? Let's dig into the science. Chondrofiller is a cell-free collagen matrix, basically a fancy gel made from purified collagen that mimics your body's natural tissue. Here's how it goes down. During a minimally invasive arthroscopic surgery, yes, surgery is involved, more on that myth later, doctors clean out the damaged area in your joint, like the knee or hip. Then they inject this liquid gel, which quickly solidifies into a stable scaffold. This scaffold acts like a framework, encouraging your body's own cells to migrate in, multiply, and regenerate new cartilage. It's designed for small defects, up to about three square centimeters, and grades three or four damage. That's the serious stuff where cartilage is worn down to the bone. Clinical data backs it up. As of 2025, over 20,000 patients worldwide have been treated with Chandrafiller. A recent study published in April 2025 in Acta Scientific Orthopedics looked at its use for knee defects and found positive outcomes in pain reduction and function improvement. Another 2025 paper on hydrogel-based autologous chondrocyte implantation, ACI, showed it's safe for larger defects with sustained results over time. Sounds promising, right? But here's the suspense. 
If it's so effective, why isn't it a cure-all? And what about those no-surgery claims? We're about to bust some myths wide open. Time for the big debunk. Myth number one, no surgery needed. Total fiction. Chandra filler requires arthroscopic surgery to apply it properly. It's minimally invasive, but still surgery. You need to immobilize the joint for 48 hours post-op, and rehab is essential for best results. Myth number two, no risks or rejection. Wrong again. There's a small chance of allergic reactions to collagen, like inflammation. Myth number three, regrows cartilage in 60 days for any joint issue. Nope, it's great for small, targeted defects, but not a fix for advanced osteoarthritis or large-scale damage. It won't replace a full knee replacement. These exaggerations? They stem from quoting a 2022 Duke University gel study and blending it with Chandra filler facts. Shocking how misinformation spreads, isn't it? But wait, if Chandra filler isn't the miracle, are there real breakthroughs on the horizon? The answer might blow your mind. While Chandra filler is solid tech, the real excitement is in next-gen innovations. At the Fraunhofer Institute, researchers are tinkering with biodegradable scaffolds inspired by jellyfish or sea cucumbers, gels that regenerate cartilage and then vanish, leaving no trace. These are still in early research, but imagine, no permanent implant, just pure healing. Over at Northwestern University, a 2024 bioactive material regenerated high-quality cartilage in sheep knees within six months, tougher than natural stuff. And in July 2025, a breakthrough dual-drug hydrogel was announced promoting cartilage repair in osteoarthritis by regulating immunity and cell growth. Then there's the University of Connecticut's injectable piezoelectric gel from June 2025. It uses electrical signals to stimulate regeneration in large animals. A 2025 study on a bioactive multifunctional hydrogel showed it could fix joint microenvironments in rats, paving the way for human trials. Don't forget Chondroguide, another German product, a collagen membrane used in AMIC procedures for over a decade, combining bone stimulation with scaffolding. These aren't ready for your doctor's office yet. Most are in preclinical or early trials, years from approval. But the suspense is killing me. Could 2030 bring truly surgery-free cartilage regrowth? The answer says yes, but only time will tell. Before we wrap, a word of caution. Social media loves hype, but it often twists facts. Pages like Forest Hunts have a track record of exaggerating. Remember their false claims about other miracles? Always check reputable sources like Medrick's biomedical site or peer-reviewed journals. If you're dealing with joint pain, talk to a doctor. Chandra filler might be an option for specific cases, but it's no universal cure. And for the future, these gels could revolutionize orthopedics, but patience is key. There you have it. The full story on Germany's cartilage gel, from viral myths to real science. If this video cleared up the confusion or sparked your interest, hit that like button, subscribe for more deep dives into health breakthroughs, and drop a comment. What's your biggest joint pain struggle? Turn on notifications so you don't miss our next expose. Remember, knowledge is power. Stay informed, stay healthy. Thanks for watching.